Yes. Hello fellow foodies and welcome back to another video on the channel. Now today, I didn't really wake up thinking, hmm, let's let's have a doner kebab, why not? I absolutely like midday, let's have a doner kebab. Um, normally, you would have them on a takeaway after a night out, but why not? I just popped into Farm Foods today and picked up a uh, doner kebab for $1.99. Could you believe it? $1.99 for a doner kebab. Like, what has it seriously got in it? Dog? Cat? I can't wait for the diarrhea tomorrow. <laughs> Who knows, it could have anything in it, but let's just hope it sort of is half decent. Anyway, let's skip. I um, hope you guys have been fantastic and amazing. I've been good. Um, yeah, just been working a lot really, but that has to be done. So let's um, skip the jibber jabber and head over to the doner kebab. One ninety nine, two doner kebabs. Two pita breads filled with delicious lamb doner meat, cabbage and onions. Speedy chef, I wonder why it's speedy. Well, we'll soon find out. And here we are, this is why it's so speedy. You microwave it, you absolutely microwave it. Here's some of the details. Um, yeah, not looking too great. Has it got cat and dog in it? No, it's got a little bit of lamb, a little bit of beef, and a little bit of chicken. Let's get this one cooked. So just a quick note, we don't even have to put these doner kebabs together. They come in a little plastic casing and you simply blitz them in the microwave and that is literally it. Um, it sounds like an absolute recipe for disaster, but never mind. Uh, let's whack it in the microwave. Right, so I'm not being funny here. Um, I'm literally just gonna have the one. I, di I didn't actually think they came in like little packs like this. So this is a doner kebab. Um, obviously, I've not stuck it in the microwave yet. And yeah, it doesn't look very appealing so far but um, it might be okay, who knows. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna just have the one doner kebab. So we're cooking it from frozen for two minutes in the microwave. I'm not sure how I feel about that. Please cook, please cook really, really well. So the doner kebab for $1.99, basically one pound each. And yeah, it's come out the microwave, it's absolutely piping hot, and this is what we got. Loads of meat in there, plenty of cabbage, plenty of onion. I mean, it's not the worst looking doner kebab I've seen. Um, they do pretty much sort of look like this. Um, a little bit hideous, on the little bit of a hideous side, but what does it taste like? Now well, let's just get to the table and eat it. It's uh, it's gonna be a good one. Hello and welcome back to the table, well I should have say, I don't know, my dining room table with me sat on the floor. <laughs> Uh, better things to come. So here it is. Here's the packaging. I've got this from Farm Foods. Two doner kebabs for £1.99. Absolutely amazing price. Hence why I went to Farm Foods and I wanted to buy this. It's a little bit wacky, a little bit different and a lot of you like me going to Farm Foods. So here it is. Here's the doner kebab itself. It doesn't look half bad. It doesn't look half bad at all. It looks okay. You know, I've seen worse and I'm not really a fussy eater but it's down to the taste test. Is it gonna taste any good? I don't know and nobody knows. Um, first of all, thank you so much for all of you watching my videos. I know I don't upload as much anymore, but that's gonna be a quite common theme for the meantime. So here we are. I'm gonna try some of this, um, some sort of meat. Um, I'm gonna get it focused on the camera, but probably doesn't wanna focus. Here it is, here's the meat. And is it gonna focus? No, good. Here we go, let's go in. I mean, got a little bit of flavour going on there. There is a little bit of flavour actually. I'm trying to work out what that is. There's a little bit of a, a little bit of a heat to it, but so far, you, you sort of get that lamb taste. I mean, so far, that meat doesn't taste half bad. That's like my local kebab shop and it's got a bit of a spice to it let me try picking this thing up it's not gonna happen is it it's so hot oh my god so what's happened is the pit of bread's basically gone soggy and i can't even pick it up now which is absolutely brilliant it's still piping hot so this is alternative to ah oh, it's just an absolute mess right so what i really need is um, a little bit of garlic mayo that'll go down the tree with this. However, I have no sauce in this house. It's some more meat. It's actually quite flavorful. Not bad. 
Right, so we've got cabbage, onion, and some meat. Uh, the meat, like I said, chicken, beef, lamb, onions. So we've got onions, cabbage, pit of bread, no sauce. But one night nine, let's give it a go. Big downside is this pit of bread is absolutely soggy, obviously, because I've had to microwave it from frozen. And yeah, when you microwave bread, it's never, never good. Overall, you've got the onions and the cabbage that give you a really good texture. And I actually bought this thinking that this was going to taste absolutely horrendous. But for £1.99 and you get two, run about 350, 400 calories. And is there any protein in here at all? Um, protein 9.5, but you don't really know what you're chewing on, to be honest with you. Um, it's quite a lot of flavour, and there's a little bit of a kick from this donami, which is like a bunch of meat obviously mixed together, and it's not a half bass. Bass? It's not half bad size, you know. You can taste the onion, it's really not bland. Cabbage is almost a little bit tasteless, but you get a little bit of texture. Overall, I'm actually quite blown away. £1.99, okay, it's not your massive kebab. It doesn't come with sauce, but get your own sauce. Just get your own sauce. Oh my god. I'm actually quite pleased. I, I thought I'd be actually really let down, and this tastes like absolute crap for £1.99 for two Donna kebabs. I thought you'd get hardly no meat. There's loads of meat here. And yeah, onion and cabbage, there could be another vegetable in there, but it's a doner kebab. So who cares? Winner! You know what, this actually isn't half bad. Um, if I fancied a doner kebab at any point, I probably would visit my local kebab, just because they're better. But if I was tight on money or something like that, £1.99 for two doner kebabs. These are not bad. These are really not bad. Hope you guys have been absolutely fantastic. Um, as like I mentioned previously, um, I've been busy working. I work five days a week now, so I get two days free uh, in the week at some point. And yeah, in that time, I'll squeeze in the video, absolutely, then catch up on things that I need to catch up on. But um, yeah, I hope you guys are amazing. And has any of you tried this before? If you have, just let me know in the comments and let me know what you think all about them. Um, Overall, I think these are very, very tasty, very, very yummy. For the price, I'm surprised of the quality. I thought these were going to be absolutely horrendous, but they're actually okay. And my mouth is actually watering. Um, I'm really, really happy. If I could give this £1.99 Donner Kebab a rating out of 10, you know what? I'm going to give it a general score. We're going to call it 7 out of 10. And it's absolutely delicious. Thanks a lot for watching. I appreciate you watching my videos so much. Hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, and yeah. Get yourself one of these for £1.99, in fact two. See you later guys, you're amazing. <laughs>